Hello everyone. Thank you all for purchasing our products. Now we will answer the questions that often arise in daily use. Question one. Don't know the default password. Answer. The default password is H H H H. Question two. The image is not clear. Answer. The camera is ten eighty p camera. When watching a video remotely via a mobile phone, select turn ATP for the resolution above the video. Question three: Cannot connect. Answer: There are two connections for Wi-Fi camera to watching video remotely. The first is that the connection is a local connection. Its principle is to connect the camera hotspot to the phone, so that the phone and the camera are connected. The second connection is remote connection. Its principle is that the camera must be connected to Wi-Fi, and the mobile phone must also be connected to Wi-Fi or the mobile phone's own network, so that. The mobile phone can remotely monitor the camera through the network. Let's introduce the operating method of these two connections. First, let's talk about the local connection method. Also called a short range connection, is to connect the camera hotspot to the mobile phone. Step one: download the app to the phone. Step two: fully charge the camera. Turn it on for one to two minutes. Step three: click Wi-Fi in the phone settings. Wi-Fi will automatically search the camera hotspot code. This camera hotspot code is the number of is the number on the back of the camera. Then click the camera hotspot encoding that appears. So right, the camera is connected to the phone hotspot. Step four. Local connection settings. Open the app. It will automatically appear the name of the camera. If the camera of the cam, if the name of the camera does not appear, automatically you can have a plus sign on the home page of the app. Click the plus sign. You can successfully add the camera to the app. At this time, a dialog box prompt will also appear. The Apple phone is like this. There is a prompt, and then there are three options: cancel the ignore, confirmation. Here, you have to select inform. If it's Android phone, it means. This wireless network has no internet access. Connect only. Choose connect here. Okay. The above four steps are about the local connection steps. But if we want to connect to watch the video remotely, further operations are needed. Now let's introduce the operating steps of remote connection. 
step one, click settings in the app, and then click Wi-Fi. Then the app is connected to Wi-Fi. Step two, connect the phone to the Wi-Fi of the environment, or your phone has a network. In this way, you can watch the video remotely when your phone leaves the camera. Spice and Watch Web For remote settings, you must use the phone and the camera together and set them in advance. But the Wi-Fi in the app cannot be set remotely. After leaving the camera, you must first connect the Wi-Fi in the app to the Wi-Fi of the environment where the camera is when the phone and the camera are together. Spice and not too. When watching video remotely, your mobile phone must maintain a network. This network can be your mobile phone connected to the Wi-Fi of your environment, or you can use your mobile phone's own network. Question 4. How to operate camera motion detection? Answer. The camera has a motion detection function. This function can only be used in a remote connection. Step 1. Keep the remote connection. Step 2. In the settings of the app, find the alarm config and click on it. You can see the related settings. You can set the motion detection alarm to be pushed every one second or every 60 seconds. The sensitivity of motion detection, you can choose medium or higher according to your needs. After the motion detection alarm is triggered, if the SD card is inserted into the camera during motion detection, one, two, three photos will be automatically taken. If you want to view the captured content, you can go to the report page on the APP homepage to view it. Question 5. How to reset? Answer. Turn on the camera first and then press 
and hold the video button for six seconds. The light turns off and then lights up again so that the reset is successful. Note that the light goes out for a short time. It will light up again. Question 6. Does not match the APP and the camera cannot be found in the APP. Answer. Reset the camera. If it still does not work, uninstall the APP and download the APP again. Because sometimes the APP will be upgraded. So uninstall it first and then download it again. Well, the answers to the above for frequently occurring questions have been completed. Thank you for listening. If you still have problem in use, please feel free to contact us. Thank you again and goodbye.